Hey, what's up guys? This is Seven Deuce Deuce. We got the top five tips of learning how to jump. All right guys, our first step in learning how to jump and having a smooth transition on our jumps is making sure we're on the balls of our feet. As you can see down here, I'm not on the arch of my foot, I'm not on the heel of my foot, we're not on the outside edge, we're right here on the ball of our feet. And what that does, it gives us a really secure feel to the bike and it's right up next to the frame, which is really cool because it actually feeds into the next part. Number two tip is squeezing with our knees. So as you can see, when I put the balls of my feet on the foot pegs like this, our, our knees are going right into this nice pocket of the bike and it's giving us a lot of control. The reason that we squeeze with our knees is so when we go off the jump, we get a little fishtail, see how much control I have over my bike and over my body, it's like I'm more one with the bike. Tip number three is we wanna be in a neutral position like so. We don't wanna be way far off the back, we don't wanna be way far off the front, each jump is going to be different. You're going to have changes, but for the most part, our neutral position is going to allow us to adjust forward and adjust backward for different changing ramps. Tip number four, we never want to do a blip off the lip, so we don't want to give it a little extra gas off the top. What we want to do is we want to be very smooth all the way off the lip and have our momentum all the way before the, you know, in the corner before the jump and just keep a consistent throttle all the way off the lip of the jump. Um, tip number five for all you guys that are first timers, you've never jumped before, these are our techniques for jumping. But you don't want to just go out and jump the biggest jump on the track the first time we go for it. So what you want to do is you want to line up a jump, look at the lip, go a little bit, go two, three feet, okay? Then you go four, five feet. Then you go six, 10 feet. Then you kind of keep working it, okay? It's something that you have to um, acquire and keep working on day in and day out. So another big thing is committing to the jump. So when you have decided that you want to do a jump, be okay with doing the jump, fully commit to it, because the more you let your body take care of it and the more you believe in yourself, the better chances are you having landing that jump. Use all five of these techni techniques and you'll nail it. Good luck, guys.